things sometimes they can feel like we're drowning they can hard times you know sorrow all that kind of stuff problems it can feel like you're drowning and you reach a hand out you might not feel the hand of God but he is reaching for you Matthew 14 30 through 31 but when he saw the strong wind and the waves he was terrified and began to sink Save me, Lord, he shouted. Jesus immediately reached out and grabbed him. You have so little faith, Jesus said. Why did you doubt me? So the strong wind is just like our, our things that we're going through. He feared the strong wind. We shouldn't fear the things that we're going to, that we're going through, because God will reach and help us through.
we were the beggars, now we're royalty. We were the prisoners, now we're running free. We are forgiven, accepted, redeemed by His grace. Let the house of the Lord sing praise. There's joy in the house of the Lord. There's joy in the house of the Lord today. And we won't be quiet. We'll shout out your praise. There's joy in the house of the Lord. Our God is surely in this place. And we won't be quiet. Hello, everyone. Happy Mad Hatter's Day. Emmanuel tells the story of Jesus' life by using all four of the Gospels, Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John, as well as the first chapter of the book of Acts and part of 1 Corinthians. This book follows Jesus' earthly life from the very beginning of the Gospel record through his many trials and his confrontations with the religious leaders of the day. This book is not intended to take the place of the Bible but it may help you understand the story of Jesus' life better by giving you a more chronological account of it. <laughs> 